Hello everyone. Today we're gonna be unboxing um, the Stream Deck pedal. Um, so a lot of the times when you see me, um, ooh, that's not good. When, a lot of times when you see me um, moving my um, ah, moving my head around when I'm starting or ending stream, it's because I'm trying to hit the stop button on my Stream Deck. Um, and so. Well, I was thinking, why not fix that? Because I really don't want to edit videos um, every time. Every time I do this, um, I'm just kind of trying to put a presence up on YouTube. It's not going to be a big thing. Um, so I got the stream pedal or the stream deck pedal because maybe I could use my feet um, instead of, you know. Uh, just reaching over to the, the stream deck over in that general direction. So, um, let's get started. So, I got the stream deck pedal. Um, hmm. Of course, that happens. <laughs> Reconnection successful. Okay, um, so we got the Stream Deck pedal. Uh, it's what is it, eighty-seven something on Amazon. Uh, it is on sale for eighty-two sixty-three right now. So that's that. Um, so again, there's three pedals, or there's three buttons on the pedal. And hopefully we can sync it up and do something today with it. So, um, how does it... Oh, this is awkward. How the heck do you get this open? Oh. Open. <laughs> Alright. Um, there we go. Oh. Wow. There we go. And then it should just, oh, it should just, there we go. And we got a bag with it, I think. We got a bag with the pedal. Um, this is, I think that's, that's what it is. Um, instruction manual, I guess. This thing some springs. Okay, so it's got like spring sets. And there's like a handful of springs and a middle pedal stopper. Huh. So we got those. We got a somewhat large cord. And we're going to need this because this is going to be on the floor. Hopefully. And then nothing else inside the packaging. Okay, so everything's just straight out of the box right there. All right. So here's the main package. Ooh. I'm going to keep it standard for right now. And if I want to, I will use the springs that they have here. What do they have? Uh, spring set 2014... Uh, 1,700 and that pedal stoppers. All right. Um, so again, let's try and see what this is. Lift that up. And we'll just pull it out. All right. All right. So right now, Yeah, it's just three buttons. That's all it is. There's nothing special about this thing. I could actually build this myself. Um, probably just using guitar, like use guitar pedals and tape three together. Yeah. Tape three together and just put a little, um, 
just a, a button on it. Like the same kind of buttons we were using for um, our projects. The mechanical switches. Yeah, the mechanical switches we can put on there. And that'd be fine. Um, so, yeah, this looks pretty easy. I don't know what that button is. What's that button right there? It looks like there's a button there. Let's read the instruction manual. Download Elgato software. Yeah, plug it in USB. Oh, use the middle pedal as a footrest. Oh, so I can just make it just n this thing not be moving at all. Okay, that's good enough. All right, so the default, if we're reading along here, the default one is 16, 800, 816. So, like, it's supposed to equal out the... Yeah. It doesn't actually equal out. This feels a little bit softer than these two. Could be that it's distributed across it. So like the 800s, you could probably get them up to a thousand if you wanted to equal the same. Because these are just like, all that pressure is on that one spring right there instead of a large surface spread out with two springs. So this, this doesn't actually equal what it's supposed to equal. Or it doesn't feel like it in the beginning. Um, later on, maybe it could, it could um, change. But as of right now, oh, as of right now, um, yeah, that doesn't look, yeah. Oh, and that's it. Download the software and maybe change some things if you want. I mean, I guess this is fine for instructions, but, eh. All right. Well, that's done. And since I have this going on, let's see if we can do this. Screen capture, screen capture, and nope. Whee! I'm there twice. Um, am I there twice? No, I'm not. There we go. But that can sit up there. Um, Elgato, where are you? There. There's Elgato. And we're going to need the Sony camera on. And let's just see what happens when I plug it in. Because maybe, maybe, uh, maybe it'll auto... Okay, so there. And we're going to plug it in right here, I guess. Hey, look at that. Look at that. Oh, get out the way. You can see it's working. New stream deck detected. Uh, do you, uh, don't, don't copy. Do you want to copy profile? No, don't copy. What the hell is this thing? Okay, so if I press the metal one, it's going to go to... Yep. Uh, this thing popped up. Yep. Okay, and I'm not going to spam my computer and just kill it with... Nope with that um i don't know what this is this little doodad here this 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 thing right here this what the heck is this thing what is this thing well anyways um we're gonna minimize this for a second we're gonna is there a way i can make it bigger 
Yep, nope. Okay. So we're going to get rid of this, to be honest. Delete that. Yeah, we're going to also move these springs because, um, yeah, no, we're, we're just, there we go. I got to, okay, wait, I need my keyboard because typing is difficult when you don't know what the keys are. All right, so we're going to do that. We're going to prop that up there. What the hell is that button? Oh, it's not a button. It's an LED. Oh, that's nice. See, it's, if you look closely that wasn't a button at all that was an LED okay so we're not okay so um stream deck all right so we're gonna do default so what do i want my three buttons to do well one i want them one of them i'm gonna make the right one turn on and off so we're gonna go should i do it from scratch or should i do it from nah we're gonna we're gonna copy this one and we're gonna go to the pedal then we're gonna go Paste that there. All right, so we got our four actions. Uh, might set up a tweet for it. Change my name because it's got that red dot. Start the stream, start recording, and then on stop. I'm done streaming, and that, and there we go. Okay, so that's fine. All right. So I don't want to press that right now. Um, just because, um, well, it'll end the stream. So, all right. That was loud. Sorry. Um, so, all right, we got a stop start button. Um, oh, that's right. Um, make myself bigger. So I'm going to create a new one. And have it as VTuber intro. Oh, wait, can I do these buttons? Oh, wait, so wait, no, no, no. Wait, so we're going to make this, um, a multi-switch? No, we're going to do this as a multi-action. So we're going to... Alright, so I need to bring this over, kind of. Oh, 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 oh. We're gonna try and make this as painless as possible. Um, so I need to. Okay, so I need to make the VTuber intro active. So we're going to go into scenes, stream, source, source. Untitled, yep. Screen capture. That's fine. And it's going to be VC face. So we're going to turn that off. So we're going to turn off the small little me there. And then we're going to do the same thing. Source. Well, not, uh, not the same thing, but we're going to make the... VTuber intro active. Then we're going to put a delu well, let's see if that works first. All right. All right. Multi-action work. 
Hey, now I'm big. Woo! So I don't have to reach over anymore for that. I don't have to um, press any of those those buttons. I should I should make this. No, 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 no. I'm gonna I'm still gonna make this a timed event because delays make me do things better? I don't know. Uh, we're gonna go for a 30 seconds, I think. Then we're just gonna copy these. Oh. Copy, paste, paste that, oh. Copy, paste, but instead of deactivating, we're gonna activate that one. Copy, paste. That's VTuber intro. And we're gonna deactivate this. Oh, deactivate. Now the thing is, um, Okay, so I'm gonna press it. Ah! My head's still in the way, isn't it? Come on, 30 seconds. I'm small again. There we go. Yep. Nope. That worked a hundred percent. That was great. Um. Hmm. All right. So the thing is, I've got to add this to all the scenes. Workbench and capture card. Um. Because these just do it for that one source or that one that one scene. Although, I could try and, if I have an intro screen, maybe I could do that better. Now I'm just thinking of ideas just to make my stream better. Um, because if I, um, what's now? If I, what's now? Have a, have an intro screen. I can set that up, have it go, and then whatever I'm doing for that day, it'll go to that scene? I don't know. Hmm. So I'm just kind of like very confused of what I'm gonna do right now. Um, for right now, yeah, we're gonna, we're just gonna, we're gonna do, we're gonna set these up to use, oh, nope. Copy, paste, that there. Wait, is there a way to put something, is there a way to bind it? Um, like a folder or something in these things? Uh, text? Nope, nope, nope. LifeX controls? Whoa! I forgot about that VC remote. Alright, we're not setting any of that stuff up today. Um... Okay, so we're gonna, from screen capture, we're gonna do workbench, VC face, that's fine. Deactivate, and then hopefully, copy that, paste that. Screen capture, workbench, source, no, we want 
Um, intro, right? Copy that, paste that. Copy that, paste that. Okay, so wait. So I gotta title these because it's gonna get really confusing. Um, screen capture VC C face off. Screen screen capture VC face or no no intro on work bench VC face off Uh, workbench um, intro on all right so this one's screen capture intro off Screen capture intro intro or no these see face on all right so no 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 oh they didn't put a control Z function in yet ah. All right, so this is going to be work, bench, intro off, this is going to be VC face on. Okay, so let's lower this time limit to like five seconds because we got to we got to we got to test this so and i'm big 5 4 3 yep okay yep and that one's good okay so next i'm going to go into workbench really quick i'm already big for whatever reason i don't know why It didn't shrink me. Okay. Oh, wait. Screen capture, workbench, VC face on, workbench off. Okay. Oh. Um, intro off. Okay. So let's try that again. Okay, it's going. There we go. All right, let's try it once more. Now I'm big. All right, and there we go. So I can, I can do that on the fly now. Um, oh, one more. So when I game, I have to also do it. Um, All right, so this is gonna be capture card. VC face off, oh. VC face off. Capture card, intro on, capture card. 
Intro on. Wait, seriously? Oh, nope, nope, nope. Okay, so this is workbench. Alright, so now I gotta do these. Alright, so these are gonna be capture card again. Intro off and triggered. Okay, so Alright, let's try this one more time. Here, let's test out this again. Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> All right, that works there. Screen capture. Oh, shoot. I was doing things without screen capture on. Oh, and how did I lose that? Um, well, that's a mystery that we can both embark on together. Um, all right, so I'm there. That's good. Oh. Let's try that again. There we go. Okay, so that one works. That one works. Um, okay, wait. Yep, let me just make sure this works. Because I don't want to change anything. There we go. Capture card. Whee! I'm big again. And then I turn small. There we go. Alright. So, um... That's going to be my changer. That's going to be my intro button. Okay, so I got my intro button, my start button, and the middle button. What's what's a good thing for a middle button to do? Hmm. I don't know. I think that's why they have those stands there. Like normally you'd just you'd create a, a function for for what like what I just did, I think. You create a multi-function button for your intro. You start and stop things, and then I don't know what else to do. Um, yeah, okay. But, yeah, this was kind of simple. Um, sorry I kind of, like, cut out, like, halfway through when I was just working on the workbench. I got focused for a second. Um, but for the middle one, I don't know yet. That could be a mute button. No, because then if I accidentally step on it, it might ruin the stream. Like, if I... I know if I step on the start-stop button, I'm going to ruin it. And I know if I hit the, the other one, I'm going to tragically <laughs> destroy the stream as well. But it'll only be for 30 seconds. Oh, wait change that to 30 seconds there we go and yeah so you know what I think we're just gonna keep it that way um, because I don't know it might um, I don't know I feel like that might probably be it. I just I'm I'm cool with what it is right now. Just cuz I have a start and a stop. I'm ready to go. Um and yeah. No, we're cool. I wonder if this can trigger it too. Nope, I can't trigger it by this little, like, Elgato thing over here. Ah! What'd I do? There we go. 
So, um, with that, guys, I think that's going to be it for tonight. Of course, I'm going to set this all up underneath my desk. And, um, I'll use it from now on to try and start and stop my streams. So, have a wonderful night, everyone. Um, and I guess I'll see you next time. Oh, wait, I need that for my outro. So, yeah. No, I'll see you guys uh, next time. Have a wonderful afternoon, evening, night. Uh, like, share, subscribe, and, you know, I'll catch you later. Bye. First time I'm using this 10 stream. Whee!